five hidden features in Illustrator, part one. What's up guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm a dive into the depth of Adobe Illustrator to find hidden features. Without further ado, let's dive in. The first one is panning while writing. I know you have been in a situation where you are typing text and instinctively held the space bar to activate the hand tool and uh, pan around the artboard but ended up adding unwanted spaces. Well, I have come up with a new trick by holding alternate with your left mouse button and pan around freely without changing anything. Tip. You can also hold control to access the selection tool to move around the whole text you are currently typing. Removing anchor points while maintaining the path. Removing anchor points to try to make it clean and smooth can be annoying and tedious. There are a lot of points you need to adjust and ended up distorted the object which you didn't want. Well, with this trick you can adjust add anchor points freely by simply hold the shift key while deleting anchor point and the whole path will be calculated by the software which is Adobe Illustrator. To delete the anchor points, you simply hit delete button on your keyboard. The third, using shortcuts to align. If you have been like me who has been accessing the align tool panel to change the alignments of the objects on the artboard. I have a solution. All you have to do is to click the edit menu and select keyboard shortcuts. Once the shortcuts open, select menu commands in the navigation and choose align. Then double click on the column we want to and assign a keyboard shortcut of your choice. Note, I recommend you to use function case which would not conflict with the pre-assigned case and then click OK to save your shortcut preset. You can now apply alignments without going to the align navigation panel which sometimes I find tedious. The fourth feature is forcing strokes and effects to scale the object. Everyone at some point has experienced this and got frustrated that scaling an object and realizes that the artwork tends to be completely a mess because strokes and effects by default do not scale with object in Illustrator. Worry no more. All you have to do is to go to Edit Menu and navigate to the bottom and select Preferences. Then choose the Journal. Once the Preference menu opens, check the box with Scale, Strokes and Effects and then confirm with OK. Now, whenever you scale with your object, with whenever you scale your objects with effects and everything scales together with no distortion. Extra tip: you can also check the box with scale around corners. 
lastly draw inside this feature is always hidden at the bottom of the navigation panel simply activate it by clicking on it this can work as a clipping mask and as you are able to add objects inside the main shape this feature is strong and so useful because it is beyond the clipping mask feature and that's all i had for you today and if you are interested in creative designing simply click the next video icon at the end of this one and vibe around otherwise thank you for watching please don't forget to like comment and subscribe